this is Alice Madness Returns Game Off Through Part El Dose. In in English, welcome back to Alice Madness Returns Part Two. Go rain. Can't go this way, love. Go rain. I might use the underground one day if they ever complete the construction. So they're building like an underground tunnel thing. I always like listening on people's conversations. Look at his nose. Wow. Yeah, yeah, none of the people are attractive. Look, here's little people. They're in love. She never worked. Where's her flat? Too good for company. She can't get close. Hates being touched. Who likes it then? Never slap. The kids are so mean. Wait, wait, because she doesn't like to be touched. I don't know. <laughs> Look, this kid's weird. She's talking to her face. No, she's talking to a wall. <laughs> Well, it's a kitty. Oh. Some ugly people. This is like old England, I think. No, we're speaking with British accents because, whoa, that guy's fat. I think that's a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Hello. First person is fun. She's selling fruits. Oh, you okay. <laughs> now that is a lady. <laughs> little kid or doing something? Uh... Isn't that guy playing the violin before? <laughs> Look! Is he murdering something? He's a butcher. Exactly. Piggy! Poor Piggy. Yeah, he pumped. Yikes. It's an <laughs> ugly man. So I think uh, that's a woman. No. Nice. What? You can talk too. Yeah, I'm only being annoying because uh, I talk. Okay. Little kid. Wait, she's not that ugly. I'll okay. teach you moving okay. this suit. I can run you in just for being off your nut. Oh. Ouch. What's going on? He's kicking. He's kicking. Wait, why did they tell? Why did they tell her? Like, move on. Like, go away. Don't watch this. Because they don't want her brain to be fried even more. <laughs> First person. Ooh. I've barely seen anyone in game review in these first person. Yeah, I know. It would just look weird. All of these things die eventually. Still, the creatures and means are always poignant. <laughs> I know where the cat went. I just wanted to see that. First person. First person. See, look, there's a prostitute. <laughs> That's a prostitute. Why is she skinny? So skinny. Because she can't feed. I mean, she can't. <laughs> she doesn't have enough money for food. So that's what she has to do. That's how she lives. Like this one. I've got a real job. No changing that. Better than being a dog's body for often. Make someone happy. Save the world. Two minutes at a time. See? She's a prostitute, too. You can tell when they are. They wear certain types of dresses. They're super skinny. And their faces are butt ugly. <laughs> you drunk guy. Dead hey. guy. <laughs> Don't know if I'm dead or not. Ooh! What happened to that? <laughs> it's the shadow. They're not a she a prostitute? Yeah. So you can tell by the way they dress. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I was assuming. First person. First person. When you go into the alleys, you have to use first person. Yeah. Following furry creatures into dark holes has become a habit. I hate that. It's not nice. Voice. <laughs> a little late. You into this guy? <laughs> yeah. I am. Now, here's the things get creepy. Sorry, guys. The fog isn't gonna help with this. It just <laughs> makes it look like white screen.
Because she knows she's insane. So. Are you scared? No! <laughs> no, that, that's her calm face. Stars and goddess. You look how ugly that person is. Look how fat her nose is. Nice witness. Won't look twice in as many months. Out on your own? You look frazzled, dearie. And not doing well? Not really. Come along home then and look at my face. Maybe she's insane. Pretty much she sees it. Like you. No. I don't think so. That's how they are. Our last visit cost me several pounds and got me nowhere. I might recall where your major rabbit got to. And cutscene. No surprise. Her kid roasted by a chestnut's right in front of her eyes. Ten years in Brooklyn, just silent, wasted everyone's time. Dr. Bombay won't do better. Still hauling out her questions. The fire, her memory. I deserve consideration, don't I? She's um, a stalker. <laughs> Throw her in jail. Where'd she be without me? On the street, selling her backside. She's a pigeon, so she's doing that. I was worth more than that. Kept her secret, haven't I? Heard her say, Oh, died on my account. I couldn't save you. I've told her my silence is for sale. She. I'm a good sort. Now I can handle that uppity whore. All that lawyer fell on Radcliffe took a stupid rabbit. Need money. Warned her I'd tell the coppers if she didn't make a donation to my Aki. She yells and goes off her head. This she can't remember her name. What I heard. So yeah. <laughs> what does that mean? Collect and treasure every memory and never count the cost. The high street was <laughs> Because that woman is keeping a secret of Alice's, and you don't know what it is. Oh, I got attacked, and I won money. Do you know what it is? No, actually, I don't. The coop is really just a cage, but the birds don't seem to mind. Okay. It's uh, she's keeping her secret. The nanny, that person, is pretty much a bad person. Is what I'm trying to say. I knew it. Nanny was bad. Not nanny. This the witless. Her name's Nurse Witless or Pris. That's the city. <laughs> Why is it like that? Because it's know. England. It's old time. Everything's in smoke now because uh, factories. Yeah. Nurse Witness, do you mean to help me to send me back to the asylum? I won't say no. I have a first you could photograph. Oh, you spoiled it. <laughs> That this is disgusting. Oh, there's a skull on her pillow. Yeah. And blood on her dress. <laughs> I thought this set was amazing. Like, the graphics in this game were really amazing. Except for the people's faces. Yeah. Like, olden time England, it's boring, but, like, they do a good job, you know? Yeah. This is one of my favorite sets. It's a very upsetting journey. As I'm rid of Chris, or whatever she's become. At least the place I've landed is somewhat familiar. She's long as Hannah. Yep. About time, too, Alice. That's a Cheshire cat. Nasty cat. Don't try to bully me. I'm very much on edge. Perfect. When you're not on edge, you're taking up too much space. You're no help at all. 
But you know I can be. I'll frighten myself. When necessary, thanks very much. I was hoping to escape from all that. Abandon that hope. A new law reigns in this wonderland, Alice. It's very rough justice all round. We're at risk here. You be on your guard. Yeah, and that's a Cheshire cat. <laughs> right now, we're in the veil of tears. <laughs> like there's a cow. How long is it? Oh, ten minutes. Uh, right, uh, we'll see you next, next time. Uh, next episode. Yep. Bye.